Captain Musalia. Very interesting first 10 minutes. Well, uh, Innocent Wafula settling in that left back position. Ali Daucho getting the treatment from Freddy Konyango. Now, opportunity for Kimani, but uh, not able to get into the box. And it's a goal for Tasca. Tasca takes the lead in the ninth minute of this game, catching the goal. Mahia defense napping. Well, 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 interesting times here in this uh, top eight game. Boniface will watch, not happy that uh, they've conceded, but uh, Kevin Kimani puts Tasca ahead in the ninth minute of this epic semi final. KPL top eight at the back. Shakava, Musa, Olusimbi. Now Pondo looking for a pass up front. Now the right to Ziki Mana crossing into the box. Opportunity. A longer shot, goal, equalizer. And Gorma here are back in action. They're back into this game. Eight minutes into the second half. Michael Olunga scores against his former club. And he's elated. Just going to salute the Gorma here fans who've been patient. Because it was only a matter of time before Gorma here came back into this game. And it took them only eight minutes to get the equalizer and put things level in this game. Because Gorma here now have the upper hand from that goal. Well, Walu Simbi dropping it to Olunga. He has the first touch and the second touch. Giving nothing to chance. Mistake. Olunga. And Gorma here look like they are dumping Tasca out of the 2015 top eight competition. Michael Olunga with a double. The fans in the stands. Uh, Singing, dancing, chanting, because Michael Olunga has scored his second goal of the game. As Gorma here now takes the lead in this game by two goals to one, making it a 4-3 aggregate, and they are the home team in this game. Olunga doing damage to his former club. Well, you don't do such mistakes and give Olunga such chances because that man is a real finisher.